Well, if you grow up working in restaurants, as I have and do, um, <clears throat> when you work in food service, you do not cook bacon ever on a griddle or in a frying pan. Mm -hmm. Bacon is baked on huge sheet trays in big ovens, industrial ovens. Okay. Usually on parchment paper, so it's sitting in its own fat. For years on television, literally 20 years, I've been telling people to use the broiler pan that came with your oven, which has the slots in it, so mm -hmm. all the fat can fall away to bake their bacon. And if they don't have that or they threw it away because it just got a little beat up over mm -hmm. the years, I tell them how to make one by putting a wire cooling rack inside a rimmed baking sheet. It took me years of designing for the kitchen to come to the super obvious idea of why don't you just make a pan that does that, dummy. And that's what this is. But Darla, nobody else even thought of that. So, so like, you were all one and first only. First of all, let me just talk about our baking pans. They are double deep. You can use them to roast meats because they have a more than an, a one inch, about an inch and a half, maybe even two inches deep. It's a double edge. See here, this bends. So you can make a traditional sheet cake or a genoise, and there's an extra barrier there. So if you're using it as a roasting pan, this is also a roasting pan. Mm -hmm. And all of my bakeware is super sturdy and, is. and very heavy and durable. It doesn't twist like that cheap stuff you get mm -hmm. in the grocery store. No. It These doesn't are, pop in the oven. It doesn't never. do that weird thunder sound in the oven. So this is a great purchase for the price, period. Just this one pan. Right. And it's a nonstick surface, of course. But then you get this insert with a little hole in the corner to make it easy to pull the whole thing out. And it has ridges on it, bumps, and holes in it. So when you put bacon on it, the fat drips underneath the bacon. The bacon shrinks evenly. It doesn't curl. Mm -hmm. And the bacon cooks evenly until perfect. it's as crisp as you like. You don't have to turn it. It doesn't make a mess on your stove. And after it cools, you can safely discard the bacon fat. Right. So it's just on and on and on the perfect way to cook bacon. Right. Unless you're putting it into a recipe to just start a soup or a chili or something, there's no need to ever put bacon in a frying pan. Right. But the crisper pan is also a roaster pan. So we have two giant chickens here with roasted veg. Mm -hmm. It crisps up store-bought or homemade onion rings if right. you're baking them in the oven. You can make, of course, you can make a, a Sicilian or a traditional pizza on them. We have some of our uh, stuffed squash with the four cheeses. Uh, even your giant uh, holiday ham you could throw on these. That's a big a guy. A whole standing rib roast. Right. A, a pork roast, a crown roast, a beef roast, a prime rib. On and on and on because of the versatility of the pan itself. Right. So it really is a must have. For bakers, I say get two, or for people that love oven fries. Because the oven fries get super crispy because the heat can get underneath right. them and all around right. them. Right? Um, you know, me, I say two isn't enough. Here's what happened, Rach. You yeah. were on the air with but David. It was an accident. It was an accident, but right. it was, but you know. I'm going to get the fries. Okay, honey. All things are meant for a reason, right? And I'm going to actually grab another one, if you don't mind, from down here for one second to show you that even though I have five, they all stack up beautifully like that. So there's not a lot of room. So Rach was on the air with David Venable, okay? And it was the original version of the pan, because this one's even bigger than better than Yeah, ever. this one's larger. The first one we yeah. did was a smaller mm -hmm. size, and I said, that's not useful enough because it doesn't hold enough fries. Right, we need more <laughs> fries. So I was clicking, like, add to cart, but you were so busy that like our website was just catching up. So the I website thought I hadn't bought, caught up yeah. with her order. I thought I only bought one, but I bought three. So it comes to my house, I have three boxes. I'm like, well, that's okay. My daughter was just moving out to her first right. apartment. I love my sister, Chrissy. I'll try, she'll want one. They did not get them because I fell in love with this pan and use it every single day. She if does you roast love vegetables. Roast, just roast vegetables. broccoli. Roast broccolini is amazing. It's like on this. so amazing. <clears throat> you know, I mean, 800 gone. I'm telling you, if you got one, come back and get another it gets one. It's super crisp. You're going to yep. use it every single day. And it's like my favorite pan ever. Well, because it's a very lightweight roasting pan, too. It really is deep enough to roast prime rib, yeah. chickens, turkey breasts a small whole turkey, a ham, a pork roast. I mean, it's a really versatile pan. I have a lot of proper roasting pans. Right. I grab this yep. more often than not because it's lightweight. Right. And you just stack two together. So right here in front of us is two. Well, you two. stack five. I stack five. 
<laughs> and My then the gift has giving five. started. But Maria starts baking Christmas cookies in like August. Yeah, well, she's the best co Christmas right. cookie so baker ever. She needs five baking sheets at all times. Crispy. So I get it. Crispy. Yeah, everything is crispy on these. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> I would let them go even more, mm -hmm. quite frankly. But okay. I mean, what else are you going to say? They're, one, two. Well, they're super affordable. I have they're one thing an to say. amazing value. Easy Pay is leaving <clears throat> us at the end of the day. Oh. So if you love Easy Pay as much as I do, it's on four easy payments of $6 and change. That leaves us at the end of the day. More than 1000 out the door. Think of the spring holidays that are coming. Passover and Easter and Mother's right. Day and Father's Day. And now Michelle wants to meet you from Hi, Delaware. Hi, Michelle. How are you? Hi, Michelle. Meet Rachel. Hi, Rachel. Hi, do you own one of our crisper pans or are you going to try one? I do. I own two of them. Do you love them? I love them. Do you bake I your bacon? I use them for everything. <laughs> yes. But do you bake your bacon? I do bacon. I roast my asparagus on them. I cook meatloaf on them. I they know, are aren't perfect. They great? Yeah, because all the fat drips away. Right. The bacon never makes <clears> a mess <throat> of the stove anymore. I mean, I love them. Yeah, they're the best. They're the best. Yes, you don't think I'm weird that I have five, do you, Michelle? You get it, right? No, I'm actually going to order two more today. See? See? I know. I, she's got five. I don't have five. <laughs> I think at the office we have like maybe, five. Like maybe. the industrial kitchen. Right. Where we do three shows a day. I think we have like probably that right. many there. In my house, I don't have five. Yeah. It's so funny. You're going to have more than me. <laughs> <laughs> so, Michelle, if somebody's if listening and yeah. saying, okay, these girls are really excited about this crisper pan, what would you tell them about picking them up? These pans are so sturdy. They're not like the junky ones you get in the store. Right, they, they don't are twist so up. They're so sturdy. They yeah. never warp. I like know, that's what I love about them, too. The and they just pop, and, and it's just horrible. Yeah, These the, are the sturdiest pans. Mm -hmm. Yeah, the ones that I used to have, too, they would, like, pop. The stuff would slide around, right. and it would, quite frankly, they would scare me. Right. You know, that the right, sound that they torque. make is terrible. Right. It sounds like thunder or something. Right. And, you know, and they I, are the easiest cleanup. My yeah. pans look brand new today as the first day I got them over a year ago. Yeah, I know. They really are. They're terrific. I really appreciate you calling in because, I mean, my name's on it. So it, people could say, oh, yeah, well, sure. It's hers. No, I, I mean, I, I really am proud of these pans. I, I've never used a pan this good. Right. <laughs> <laughs> and, you know, I know, Michelle, I was looking to try and find out. We have sold so many of these, both in this size and the small size. Right. But I think it's because we keep coming back for more because we're like, we're using this pan. My own sister buys any them other. on air. Right. Let, yeah, Thank exactly. <laughs> I can't and get. And I own so many Rachel Ray yeah. products, and they are oh, all thank phenomenal. Aww, thank you. Thanks, I really Michelle. appreciate that. We really work very hard on our brand. And I won't use anything we don't use on the show or that I wouldn't use in my house. So that means a lot. And to I me. just love you, Rachel. I've been watching you forever for Thank 30 you. minute meals. Oh my God. 30 minute now. meals is coming back April 1st on Food Network. Woo! I just. No way. I swear to God. It starts no. on April 1st. Every day at noon is a new episode. Oh my God. I just gosh, shot I'm them so last excited. week. I <gasps> shot the first 15 last week. I'm writing the next 15. Here you are doing it in the. At in the QVC. Free room. I'm writing them right now. Ah! We're filming them oh in Brooklyn. Gosh. It's an all new kitchen. You're going to flip. And they have an app or something mm -hmm. where you can watch online, and they show you a little screen within a screen. Like on uh, Saturday Night Live, right. they show you what happens during the commercials <gasps> and everything so people can see that they're really 30 minutes. It's amazing. Oh, how cool. It's amazing. You're going to be so, so excited. Tune I in. I can't yeah. wait. April 1st, brand new. Woo! Yeah. And, and use your crisper pan while you're watching. Right I know. It's so Yay. exciting. Thanks, Michelle. <laughs> Thank you. Thanks, honey. Bye, Bye. Michelle. Bye -bye. I'll wait till she needs, sees the oh new 30-minute meal. So excited. Woo, 2000 it's be out fun. the door. Many of you are, get, are taking Michelle's idea and doing more than one. Can we go back to the just to the, the, the one that's empty and show everybody sure. what you did? Because, okay, I don't I did five of anything in the kitchen, but I do on this guy. All I did Woo. was make Mitch. Yes. a pan that essentially replaces your old broiler pan. It's a super deep, a double deep uh, roasting pan that you can make a sheet cake in, but it's also got an extra lip on it. So it's deep enough to roast a prime rib, two chickens, a small turkey, a huge ham, on and on and on. And the insert pan has all these little holes and ridges. So when you put bacon on it, the fat drips away. Um, as Michelle was saying, if you made meatloaf, the drippings would go underneath, slide underneath, on and on and on. If you're keeping cutlets crisp in the oven, the heat can circulate. If you're making roast broccolini or roast broccoli mm -hmm. like Jane does 
almost every day. Uh, uh, you want to put that every down? Day. My daughter eats broccoli almost every single night for dinner. So they made a sheet pan of uh, brownies here. Yeah, yeah. But this is, you know, traditional size for a large sheet cake. Mm -hmm. I mean, it, it's just a useful pan. Our pans don't twist uh, on and on and on. It's just a great baking sheet in and of itself. Right. But the crisper insert is what makes right. it so different. And you say, okay, Jane, why do I have so many? Because I'm lazy and I don't have her husband to do the dishes all the time, although my Sean is a really good dish guy. <laughs> but like in the morning, it's going to be, you know, the breakfast, the bacon tray, whatever. And then when we get closer to the main meal, I often have like chicken with maybe some sweet potatoes that are in the oven all in one. And then I got to make these broccoli all the time. Okay, now I'm up to three. And then well, we also have cooking. to make dessert. Yeah, we do a lot of it in the magazine and on the show too. People love it. It's... Sheet pan cooking is a trend right now. It's I love just it. like one skillet or one pot, right? Except you're using a sheet pan instead. Mm -hmm. So any night of the week, you can take one inch thick pork chops, boneless, skinless chicken breast or chicken thigh, um, sausages, vegetables of any variety, mm -hmm. scatter it over the pan, douse it with olive oil, salt, pepper, dress it with some herbs, and shove it in the oven, and dinner is done. Right, right. And you just take the whole pan to the table and serve from the table, you know, right That's from the pan. That's why you need more than one. 3,000 of these gone just in the show. The Easy Pay is leaving us at the end of the day. Don't forget, only till tomorrow night, right. if you get a, yourself a Q card, you can put everything on six Easy Payments and get a $40 credit. Right, so, so for some of more. these products, we were just saying, They're, you actually get a negative, yeah, balance. like a, a positive <laughs> negative. Like if something costs $20 and you're getting a $40 credit, that means you still got 20 bucks to spend. Yeah. Mm hmm. On more Rachel. That's kooky. On more Rachel. That's so fun. I don't fun. understand how they do business here. I don't either. I'm thrilled to be a part of it, but they are insane. I and what used to be called layaway, like that, <laughs> this payment plan thing, if you left the store before you finished paying, they would arrest you. Like, I don't get how you guys make a nickel. You know, but I quote I don't all the care. time. Yeah. Like, Rachel says that True. would be called stealing in it the would old be days, but theft. we're going to yeah. send it to you now. So, anyway, this is a hot pick. That means it's a star of the day. We're going to keep this out here because we've got a cool mat that we've all been standing on. But we're going to keep this out here so Rachel can come back and